I have a special treat for you today. I'm gonna show you how to make the best, easy, giant crunchy tostadas. What I have in our bowl is shredded rotisserie chicken. Go ahead and add your pepper, garlic powder, ground cumin. Combine all your ingredients with your hands. That'll allow everything to stick a little bit better and that's what we want. We wanna coat this chicken with all those delightful seasonings. Take your burner, set it on a medium heat, and add a little bit of oil. Today I'm using avocado oil. Add your chicken. Friends, we get asked often, where did you purchase your pans? These pans can be found in our Amazon storefront and Cloud will link it in the description area for you. If you don't know who Cloud is, that is my sister and she helps us get these amazing angles. Hi, Thanks, everyone. Cloud. <laughs> Sorry, I was so excited to say hello ooh, to everyone. Ooh, hi. <laughs> Continue to sear your chicken on that side without moving anything for two and a half minutes. After two and a half minutes, you wanna start mixing your chicken. And the reason we're doing that is because we need a few of those pieces to be nice and crispy. In our cup, I have a little bit of chicken bouillon and some warm water. Go ahead and add our mixture. And we're gonna cook for another two and a half minutes. What that mixture is gonna help us do is to keep our chicken nice and juicy. After two and a half minutes, you wanna turn your burner off. Give that a quick mix. And we're ready to start preparing our giant tostadas. For a quick and easy salsa, I have a serrano, tomatoes, tomatillo, and some garlic. I boiled it for about 10 minutes, and now we're gonna place all of this in our blender. I'm gonna add two ladles of our water that we use to boil our ingredients, salt, and we're gonna blend until smooth. And boom, done! The tostadas I'll be using today are from Tostaderia La Fe. They are giant, this is the size of my hand, and these are the tostadas. Let's go ahead and start assembling. To your giant tostada, add some sour cream. I am using the Lala Mexican sour cream. You can use a little bit of mayo. You can make it comfortable for your home. Add your juicy chicken, lettuce, purple pickled onions. Recipe will be in the description area. Cubed avocado, cotija Mexican cheese, and some salsa. I like mine with a little bit of extra sour cream. Thank you. 